production function is that part of an organization, which is concerned with the transformation of a range of inputs into the required outputs, products, having the requisite quality level. Production may be understood as the step-by-step -step conversion of one form of material into another form through chemical or mechanical process to create or enhance the utility of the product to the user. Thus production is a value addition process. In any manufacturing enterprise, the main objective of production department is to produce the things in desired quantity at desired time so that they may be made available to end users when they demand it. Production being a very complex process is very difficult to manage for the people. This includes a large number of activities and operations which need to be planned appropriately and in turn controlled for the effective production of the output. The main purpose of Production Planning and Control PPC, is to establish routes and schedules for the work that will ensure the optimum utilization of materials, workers, and machines and to provide the means for ensuring the operation of the plant in accordance with these plans. There are different types of production systems. The choice of production system depends upon the nature of products, variety of products and volume of products. These production systems have been discussed in this chapter in detail. Entrepreneurs, after finalizing the production system to be used are required to go for the production planning and control, PPC which essentially depends upon the type of production system. Production planning and control is necessarily concerned with implementing the plans, that is the detailed scheduling of jobs, assigning of workloads to machines, and people, the actual flow of work through the system. Production is an organized activity of converting raw materials into useful products. Production system requires the optimal utilization of natural resources like men, money, machine materials and time. Production planning and control coordinate with different departments, such as production, marketing, logistics, warehouse and other departments depending upon the nature of organization. Production planning and control receives data related to orders from marketing departments. Production plan based on marketing and production data is prepared in production planning and control. This production plan provides clear idea about utilization of manufacturing resources for production. Prepared production plan is delivered to production department. Production department manufacture products according to that plan. The ultimate objective of production planning and control, like that of all other manufacturing controls, is to contribute to the profits of the enterprise. As with inventory management and control, this is accomplished by keeping the customers satisfied through the meeting of delivery schedules. So, what are the main objectives of PPC? It is used to establish target and check the deviations by comparing on some performance measures. Decides the nature and magnitude of different input factors to produce the output. Coordinates different resources of production system in the most effective and economic manner and to coordinate among different departments. Elimination of bottleneck. Utilization of inventory in the optimal way. Smooth flow of material. To produce in right quantity and quality at right time. Scheduling production activities to meet delivery schedule. Expediting the system under production. To ensure flexibility in production system to accommodate changes and uncertainty. Optimizes the use of resources for minimum overall production cost. To ensure the production of right product at right time in right quantity with specification rightly suited to customers. Stable production system, with least chaos, confusion and undue hurry. The next few lectures of this course will deal in detail with the concept of production planning and control. This will help the students to understand the PPC to be used for the different types of production systems along with their merits and demerits. This will also make them familiar with various constraints in PPC.